guys, it's Kendra. Today I'm here to do a holiday, I didn't realize Kylo was in there, she just freaked me out, a holiday decor haul. I got a lot of new Christmas things and I wanted to share them with you guys now in case you are out and about doing shopping or if you just need some ideas, I wanted to share those with you. So I kind of went a little crazy because for the girl's birthday, which is on, it's December 16th, I'm doing a winter wonderland theme since we're turning one. So I thought it was an excuse to get some more holiday decor. That's my rationale. So because of that, I went with a little bit more of like a wintry theme. Obviously my de decorations usually are more rustic, but this year I wanted to do things more whites and metallics with, you know, pop little pops of red here and there, but mostly more neutrals, feminine things and just softer, not so rustic. So I hope you guys all enjoy this. I have stuff from Michaels, a ton from Michaels, some things from Target and uh, also Walmart. I found some things as well. So let's hop right in. Okay. I'm going to start with Target. So I saw these and it kind of inspired me for just what I'm going to do for my decorations. It's this garland and they're little pom-poms. So I thought this would be super cute to have in a retreat. So it's going to be kind of like a whimsical metallic theme. I got two of these so I can string those around the tree. I think they add a little bit of fun. I also got this garland which is shedding everywhere. This one's from Michaels. This is part of their boho holiday. It was originally $24. What is the The one from Target was $10. The Michaels one is 24, but I believe this was 40% off. I think everything that I got from Michaels was 40% off and some was 50. So I would never pay full price at Michaels. And then also I used coupons. So this one was hanging just kind of along the side wall. It's really long. I'm not too sure what I'm gonna do with this one yet. I think I'm going to hang it kind of like this along our, we have a little bar area. So I figured it'd be cute there, but I like it because it looks like snow and there's also a little bit of gold in here. So again, loving the pom-pom theme. They also had a ton of really cute, kind of rainbowy pom-pom garlands. I did buy some pink things, like hot pink, and I was going to do like, like kind of an evergreen color with golds and then also hot pink. But then I thought I wouldn't be able to really use a lot of my red decor, and I have a lot of red things, so I felt like That'd be wasting a lot of the stuff I already had. So I returned the pink stuff. I'll show you that when I get to it because I got other things, just not in pink. But next, I got this garland from Michaels. This was $19.99, and again, I think these were half off. So this is two of them combined. It's a really long piece. It looks like kind of, you know, branches from a tree, and then it's covered in a little bit of white and also silver glitter. So I'm not too sure where I'm gonna put these yet. I'm thinking on, we, in our hallway, we have this kind of table area, so I might put it there. But yeah, I thought this was super pretty and this just went with kind of the whole theme I have going on this year. All right, next I have a lot of picks for the tree. I wanted to really change up what our Christmas tree looks like this year. It's going to be in a different area of our house because where we typically keep our Christmas tree is where the girls play and that's not gonna happen. The first ones I got are these white ones. They're white with silver glitter and these were $149 and I think all the picks were half off. So I got a bunch of these ones to stick in. I thought this would just add a lot of white to our tree. In an ideal world, I'd have a flock tree, but I don't know if Andrew would let me get a flock tree. So I got some stuff to make it look like it's flocked. And then I got a bunch of flocked garland, which I'll sh show you after this. So this pick, again, it has like that flock look to it and the little white beads with some pine cones. So I got a bunch of these too to just, again, fill up our tree and give it more of a white look. The next picks I got are these really fun fur ones. I thought these would make the tree look really pretty and feminine and again, kind of whimsical. So I got a ton of these to just stick in the tree. And the last type of pick I got are these really pretty kind of, whoop, part of that just fell off. They're like little branches, but they're in kind of a champagne glitter. So yeah, love those. Okay, next I got this frame from Michaels. Again, this was $14.99 and I got it for half off. And it says joy to the world. And I'm going to hang this in our kitchen. We have a little 
area on the wall that I love to hang little signs, so I thought this one was really pretty. Next, I got a bunch of bottle brush trees, which I am so excited about. I was looking for these, and when I saw them, I just seriously thought I scored so big. I got two boxes of them. I think these were buy one, get one half off, but you can get use a coupon on the other one to make them both half off. So they're $24.99, so you can get them for like um, about $12. So I got one box. I put them all in here because I'm like a little kid when it comes to stuff like this and have to open it up. But this is what the boxes look like. They're the tiny treasures. And so one of them was all green trees. So it comes with three big ones and three little ones. And it also has a different shade of green. So this one's like a darker teal. And then this is a little bit whoop, more of a brighter kind of blue green. And then the little cute trees. I think I'm gonna put those on the mantle, but I might put them on our dining table. I'll definitely do um, a decor video once I have everything done. And then here's the other color. So it came with two of these really pretty kind of coppery trees. And then this, this is all stuck to me. Uh, kind of like an ivory with gold on that one. And then here are the little guys. Oh my god, this is completely stuck to my sweater. So there are those. And they had a bunch of other colors too, so I feel like no matter what your color scheme is, you could definitely find some that would work for you. When I was shopping at Michael's, I had so much glitter all over me. Next I got this little cute nutcracker. I just think it's really pretty. I love the blush color. This was $12.99, but I got it half off, so seven bucks for this cutie. I also got these ornaments from Target. I forgot about them. They're in the bottom of the bag. I think I got two of each of these. They're down there somewhere. So I have the gold ones and the silver and they're just kind of twirly, looks like icicles to me. So those would be pretty on the branches. And then I also got these really pretty ornaments from Michaels. I got a couple of the gold and a couple of the silver. I did originally get some in hot pink, but I returned those because it just wasn't going to go with everything else, but I really liked kind of the boho look to these. They had some really cute boho things in that collection. And then I did buy a couple of hot pink bottle brush trees, and those, again, went back with the hot pink ornaments. Two more things from Target. I don't know why I only got the garland from there. <laughs> Everything's kind of all over the place. But these gold measuring spoons just caught my eye, and I thought they'd be really pretty to use, and if I'm doing any holiday posts, I thought they'd be fun. And I got this mug too. I'm a sucker for coffee mugs. And this one's gigantic and it was only $3, so I had to get it. I also got this super pretty snowflake from Michaels. I don't have the tag anymore because I already took it off, but it wasn't that expensive. And I'm gonna hang this on the wall. I think this is so cute. And last up for Michaels, I got this little tree. It was $24.99, I got it half off. And I love the base to it and that it looked kind of flocked. Not too sure what I'm gonna do with this yet, but it will have a place. Last up from Michaels is my flocked garland. I was going to flock my own garland myself, but after I looked at all the stuff that I needed and the time that it would take and how much it was gonna cost, I was like, you know what? It's not that much more to just buy this. These were super inexpensive at Walmart. I couldn't believe it. And the reviews were so good. So this one is nine feet flocked garland. I wanna say that, oh yeah, $12.96. That is crazy. The actual like flocking stuff on Amazon was 20 something dollars and then you have to buy a sifter and glue and all this stuff. So I just couldn't believe this. It's such a good steal. And then this, I'm not gonna take out yet, but it's essentially the same thing, but it's pre-lit. So it was a little bit more expensive than that. Not that much more, but this one I wanna put on our mantle because it has lights on it. Before I did just some fairy lights on our garland and it was cute, but I kind of like that this has bigger lights. And the last thing that I got was a wreath. It's not here yet, but I don't want to wait to film this until that came because who knows when that's going to get here. But it looks a lot like that garland. Okay, I wanted to show you guys the wreath because it came in the mail today. So I just um, kind of separated the branches a little bit. And I also made a quick run to Michael's to get some picks for it. So it comes just like this, not with any of these extra things in here. So I got a couple of these little cluster ones that are gold and some silver ones. And then I had two larger pine cones and then I got like five of those gold picks. So I really like it. It's pretty big and I just have a normal like bronze wreath hanger that we use all the time. So very impressed with Walmart. Who knew? 
But anyways, thank you guys so much for spending the time with me today. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you are new, and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you very soon. Bye.